We finally faced the the piercing duo. Oh, sh hello. Uh oh, knock it. How's it going, everyone? Avenger Senpai here, and today we are back with some more Dragon the Ancient's Gates. In a previous episode, we took care of an invisible war talk, got the magic bracers from him, and uh, wow, you are kicking my ass. I know, dude. It's it's been a struggle. And then we we died. That's cool. That's a nice sneak attack. Alrighty, we made it back here. And there were a few dragons along the way. Just well, the usual nonsense. Here you are. The Warthog's gauntlets, as you requested. You you found him. My men have been hunting for weeks for that thing. You just prance in here and find him and just like that. Just that easy. I didn't say it was easy, but there you are. He won't be robbing you anymore. Now, about that sword. What? Oh, come on. Now, I wasn't serious. What? No? Come on, That's dude. That's too bad. Well, I suppose I could just put these back where I found them, then. No, no, wait. You can have the sword. Just give me those damned gauntlets. What a Maybe laugh. when those are melted down into slag, I'll finally be able to sleep again. Wait, why would you melt them yeah. down? That's the last of Wouldn't Zagora's you have any buttons. good use for them? Let's hope he knows what to do with them. Ah, huh, that's odd. So, let's return to Zagoro, but first I need some health. Alrighty. We're back at the non-wild wild west tundra. On the northern part of it, and from the VOD. Oh, hello good sirs. When I was looking at the VOD, I noticed that little cavern down there, so we're gonna check that out. It probably just has, you know, like... Got this real quick. One of the stone tablets. That's probably nothing special. There was also a place in Sardana. Really early game when I watched my original playthroughs. Where it was like full of spiders and had a few Grohl and Warthogs. So that cavern didn't have anything special, just a Excellent. few scavengers. You have everything we require. And a stone tablet. I'll make my preparations at once. But it seems there are complications. There certainly are. The half-men are massing for an offensive. My men are in place. But I could use your aid. Remember, I need to get close to disable the barrier. Be certain you clear all the half-men from the area. Are we going to teleport there? But I only have enough men for This one is why it was this. crucial to repair your gear bring reinforcements. and heal My up preparations won't take long. at the scouting camp up in the, in the north. May. I'm afraid I can't waste because my you wouldn't have been travel. able to do it here. Wrestling with the spirits will demand all of my so, strength. So, in my original playthrough, I didn't do that. Yes, there might and be I got my idea. ass kicked by the halfman. Really? It was a bit of a struggle. Go with Rand Wolf and drive back the halfman. I can wait for Zagoro. Once he's ready, it will take but a minute to reach you. And why am I doing the fighting? You're the one who can breathe fire. That's true. Well, then we'll trade places. I will drive back the half men, and you can carry Zagoro on your back. <laughs> no, no. Your plan sounds better. Wait, why can't you do Let's both? Move, then. Carry him and drive them back. You do that with Rin all the time. Come on now. Man, these loading screens. They don't fool around. I suppose this game is really big and open. So, it's no surprise it has lo long loading screens for a PS2 game. Oh, synchronize this mount, nice. There it is, there's Here a gate. Here they come! Make ready! We will need to slay them all if Zagoro is to get to the barrier. Prepare yourself. Okay. There they be. The beastmen have arrived with their weird zigzaggy, wavy weapons. The chads. I love how they walk. They just close the door behind them. Okay. So let's help out our boys. If only we could aim. Ten times he. Ooh. That's not cool. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, my boys were kind of useless, huh? Yeah, these guys hurt like hell, so. Imagine facing them with a. Uh, Broken weapon and no armor. That's what I had to deal with. No, the lads, they're all dead. Only the leader is alive.
That is a really odd barrier. Oh, so it's not a gate. I thought it was going to be a gate. What's going on here? <laughs> the boys. I'm my boys. Wait, what's in this area? Hello. Where are we? Do we get to Hmm, I see. Okay, so let's head on in. We'll talk to you, baby. No, no talking. No talking, no talking. Okay, that's cool. So, we head on in, we kick some ass. Even Arok doesn't wanna. Wait, I need you, Donut. Come on. Let's go. Let's eat it on. I'm not gonna make that mistake twice. Ooh. Definitely don't want to go through those loading screens. So this is the area where we'll find the ice blade. These half men are new to me, but they seem capable of much more than appearances would suggest. If these are their lands, we should move with caution. So these guys weren't around and like what was this? Sundry years ago? Interesting. A new breed of enemy goes. I mean, that is quite a long time for a new, new people to move into the area. Maybe you just hadn't explored the whole world yet, I guess, or something, because it's under years, it's still a bit, <laughs> it's not enough time for a new species to develop, so unless they were artificially created or you just never met them, like, new to the area. What the hell is this man doing? Did I originally come here with an uh, arrow? Because it kind of feels like it. The archers, they are tanky as all hell. Hold up, excuse me, good sir. Let me just double up. Yep. See that? Ah, that's what hurt like hell. You icy dragons that are very no one. Why am I. Wait a second. I just noticed I wasn't using our OP attack. These guys. These guys. These guys, these guys, these guys, these guys are gonna kill me. These guys killed me. Damn. Alrighty, we're back here. These these slides are too quick to go with the standard, you know. Oh my god. <clears throat> to go with my special feisty oh, missile thing. If that makes any sense. So I'm gonna have to use the lightning bolt, which is much easier to hit enemies with. God damn it, come on. Maybe load all the way back. How oh, dare you. I think these are the deadliest dragons we'll be facing. God, they're so agile. And they hurt. So that's the reason they're going to be the deadliest ones. There will be like two more new types. I think they're like bad dragon seasons. Oh, they're average looking black wings. Well, not really average looking, they do look a bit different. So I'll have to keep an eye out for anything suspicious. This is a brand new area. Blue torch? What the hell does that mean? I don't know. Well, I've died twice already. This uh, it's not looking too good. It's looking like <laughs> I'm getting my ass kicked a bit. Let's keep exploring around. Try to see if we find some secret weapons. So Arok, any time there's like a special cutscene or you go to a new area, I think he just switches to the default attack. And that's what transpired there. That's why we had the fireball. Nice and ready. What's a map to this area? Is there a map? Okay, that's a little small map. Checking every nook and cranny, just in case there's anything special here. Hello, good sir. Good, bye, good sir. <laughs> I think you're too thick to fit in this spot, arrow. So I'm not sure if it's exactly in this area or a spot up ahead where the ice blade sent. So as soon as we clear everything out, I'll probably just look it up real quick. I want that sword, whether I have to cheese it, cheese to get it or not. 
keeping my eye out for those pesky dragons. There's a path to the right. Path right here. Oh man. Just land, bro. Eric. Eric land. Ah, oh, shit. I should have gotten a dragon with better landing capabilities. There we go. Just, just took five years to do. Thank you, Eric. Always a pleasure. Uh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, good sir. Mm -hmm. Not bothering with every barrel. Just attempting to find a special weapon. No sneaky special weapon there. Just gold, and I'm stuck again. Stuck again. Stuck again. Path to the right, and a path here. We'll check the path here first. Then we shall explore what's on the right. So what's the point? I don't understand the point of these areas. Come on, Arrow. Because... Wow, there's three of them just lined up. Because it's like... Help me out, Arrow. Thank you, Gitsu. Step outside. I mean, if he could actually damage you. That's why he's like, step aside. Oh, shit. Something. Ignore that. Where's the Batman? Give me a second. That's a location we want to check out. Where's he at? I know you're here somewhere. Yeah, there. Is that far enough? Mm, almost. No cigar, though. You gotta do it from way up far. Unless I'll close up on you. And do this bullshit. God damn it. I hate you guys so much. I feel like the lightning attack uses a bit too much dragon mana. <laughs> For what it's worth. Alright, so I didn't find anything of interest back there. That is a funky turret you got there. We'll just keep moving forward. I don't believe the ice blade is in this area yet. I think it's all the way at uh, the final stage of this arc. So, we'll just keep flying around. You get a pesky... Oh, shit. Wrong move. Pesky lightning... Not lightning. Laser beam dragon here. I'll take care of that. And I'll skip ahead once again. To when we engage or find something of interest. Keep pushing on. We have to make it through that gate down there. I got you, Arrow. So there's a special fun little gate we're gonna have to go through. Nice. Let me just take care of these slides real quick. That is a giant. How do you guys have such fancy turrets? Just wait a second, good sir. Oh look, a giant. Damn. It's not like I have a dragon or something. That'll just insta kill it. A riveting fight. There's not gonna be anything special here. But I'll check it nonetheless. Okay, finally. Finally, we make it here. And it seems Arok can, uh, you can join us. You know, a little trek. Which is always nice. That man was hauling booty. Very bad. What am I doing? Wrong move. That's what I'm doing. Uh-oh. I'm frozen? Let's not do that, gents. <laughs> Messed up. Oh, silly me. See, what I wanted to do was switch to the... What is it? <laughs> the flamethrower. Since I didn't know there was going to be that many of them, I underestimated them. Once again, and that cost me. But... We're back here. Um, is there anything of particular interest around this corner? Not just a, just a few little boxes, little barrels. Apparently, Arok can't take down a wooden gate. With <laughs> even with fire, he could just burn it down. So this part, I'll always find quite funny. <laughs> Arok can't open this gate. But uh, from here on out, we have no help from Arok. And it is just... Just us surviving. Try not to get yeeted out of the hurdles. Can I take you out before you do? 
So they have ice bows, so we gotta watch out for that. That man's all an ass. He, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're just gonna run around? Maybe attempt to come down here? Hey, you can't be cocky if I'm the one kicking your ass. I think you can tank this boost. Get out of here. So, <laughs> we're gonna have to take care of these lads, huh? Oh, okay. Let's check what's over here first. I'm saving like crazy. I am a saveaholic. And I'm proud. Um, oh, damn. I, I can't get up this way? Shit. Alright, I suppose we'll maneuver around here. Let me take care of you first while I'm getting shot at. Let's move back and forth. That's how you do it. It's that easy. There's someone right behind me, isn't there? No? Was that my hair glitching out? That was weird. Rather suspicious. But I'm gonna haul ass. Try to get him. Oh, that's a crossbow you have there. Nice little crossbow. It's a shame it doesn't do you any good at close range. There we go. Hmm. Now then. What to do? The ice blade should be here somewhere. I think. <laughs> Let's explore around. Alright, gents. Might you point me in the direction of the ice blade? Thing here. Ruby. That's a ruby. Oh, that's not good. So what is on the left path? And is this where we want to go? That hurt like hell, by the way. We'll be taking this left path. Let's see what's over here. Seems a little bit suspicious. This, oh man, I might not want to come down here. That's the thing with this area. Hmm. Is this the right path? Because if it is the right path, it's not the path we want to be in. That might be how I missed the ice blade. Oh, uh, shit. Let me look it up real quick. <laughs> Alright, so no need to worry for now. The ice blade is all the way at the end of this mission. And I don't know what's over there, but I really don't care. <laughs> oh, hello. Sister Ninja, you said the dragon girl I don't even know if we, we had been able to access she that uh, area behind us. And now she runs loose in the inner compound. Where's the egg you promised? Calm yourself, Morgan. The titty demons the are back. The is more resilient than we'd imagined. But the luck cannot hold out forever. Brother Yadin is right. Oh, it's you I'm a my lady. To organize your I think. As we have counseled, she would never have is made it? it so far. I can't even if tell. If you had taken Raven's hold in time, the first gateway would they have the same closed, and the Northmen <laughs> would not have been reinforced. Oh, uh, body type. Our master considers the same structure. Failures to be yours. Maybe he just has a really feminine voice. You said she would never make it to the Northlands. What of your assassins? Our agents have proved less capable than we hoped. Yeah, I hate to see it. Our master is beginning to suspect he has overestimated your abilities. I suggest you make reparations quickly, or he may choose to cut his losses in this region. Mega. I have her sent. She's somewhere there. Oh, damn. Go. So, see to your troops. We will deal with the woman ourselves. Well, here we go. We finally faced the, the piercing duo. Oh, shallow. Uh oh. Knock it. Gentlemen. Gentlemen, 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 gentlemen. Okay. I, I have realized now that I must deal with. You while well, using my very sweaty blade. My god. I too have lifesteal. Prepare to get cheesed. Come back. You know, this fight is actually not that bad. As long as you have the very nice blade. 
That gives you lifesteal. Very nice. But obviously, we couldn't have <laughs> used our bow there. They're too sweaty. So we'll just head on down and see what awaits us. They're kind of underwhelming. I mean, they did do a good amount of damage, but... That fight? Not, not that hard at all. Unless your armor was broken. Then it would have been a nightmare. Because that... That attack that was like a little newt would have done a lot of damage. A little poisonous newt. Okay, now we'll just keep moving forward. I'm not sure how I've edited the episode, but I'm going to trust <laughs> that we are fine. Due to um my skills, my little editing skills. It seems um, in those previous episodes where I was worried about going over to them, I, I was actually fine. So hopefully, that's going to be the same case with this one. Even though, Jesus Christ, right now I am running at, well, 218. I'm running at like, what, I'm 50 minutes in on my end. What's this? Something we can't use. Nice. Skull Crusher. 8 skill needed. 30 AP. That is a very nice weapon. Cow is going to like that weapon. And now we're here, and now well, there's nothing to do. So I I guess I'll just head back. <laughs> so I have no idea where how that skull crusher guy did a Houdini on me, but we'll just explore this area which we haven't checked out. Maybe I don't believe that was an optional fight. Damn. Even though we did get a really good weapon from it. Let's uh, just use this real quick. So we'll just continue heading forward. Um, there's a few enemies here. A little bit more at speed. Damn it. I almost forgot about that attack. A little bit more at speed to check out some hidden areas to explore. We might not find an ice blade here, but we should be able to find some weapons. Oh. I guess we are supposed to be here, since you mentioned Mole Guy. That's the enemy. Oh no, my boys. I hate to see this. How the hell? Where, where do we have to go? <laughs> I am in dire need of directions, good sirs. You could point me in the right way. Um, uh, well, I guess this is the right way. Is that down there? I hear a little scavenger. So, one, oh, hello. That's maxed out. We can't max it out anymore. That's cool. We actually agree with that. Hmm. I, I guess I can mess around with magic. Oh, there might be a blade we could use. I don't know. Oh, I'll just go with magic. Yeah. Nah, you know what? I never use magic. We'll go with this. Yeah, let's, let's screw it. We'll just... <laughs> we'll just put it on melee. Magic, I'll leave for when I do the magic playthrough. And... Let's see how this goes. A uh, little melee doesn't hurt. When you are using... Oh, shit. You're doing a bow run. I'm doing a bow run, but I'm still running around with a sword. It's because these guys are so chunky. And it's such a good melee weapon. The the bows are... I gotta say, underwhelming. I mean... They, they're decent? But due to the enemies being able to close in the gap so quickly... Like this. Every single enemy can do that. It's... It's not, not too good. I mean, you could use it to, to poke them from long range. But they close the gap quite quickly. So you will mostly be using melee. There we go. Now, I believe we have to go down there, but first, what's up here? I do like the bows, though. They're interesting. It's just, they, they could have been better. Or... They could have made it so that the enemies 
not every single enemy can close the gap so quickly. They're good for the really big enemies like the the giants. So there's that. But for normal combat, it's there's just so many better melee weapons that you're like, well, I'm just gonna whip out my sword. Uh, sh I guess we gotta go up here. This is feeling a bit open and barren. Have we made it all the way back around? I have no idea where I'm going, by the way. Yeah, I guess we have to go all the way up here. That's odd. What's the spot? So there's that back there, then what's in here? I don't even know what the hell's going on. I'll check out what's over there. So it ended up just being like some gold and a rusty longsword that was in the cave. A little path. We're gonna be checking out what's over here. This should be the right path. And from traveling around, it seems like we've reached a point in the game where you start noticing a lot of empty spaces. And by that I mean no enemies, not really any, any point of interest. It's just empty land. Like there's a few containers here and there and all that jazz, but... You know, it just feels empty. And I'm not sure if... Oh. What do we take? Oh, we, I remember this spot. I'm not sure if the developers just... ran out of budget. And they... they just wanted to start... they started rushing the game. So... you... they just like... started putting enemies here and there, but... Not completely flushing out the areas, or if it's because of the PlayStation 2's capabilities, it was just... It was just not enough, and we're dead. There go our legs. <laughs> oh! Not like this! Rain! That backhand slap was unwarranted. I mean, I, I kind of have. These are our lands. You trespass here, you die. Bro, I just want to get to the gate, okay? You're the ones that started trying to kill me. With your drill sipes or whatever the hell they are. But, that's gonna be it for this episode, everyone. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and thanks for watching. In the next episode, I like how I had my armor in the cutscene, but now I'm completely stripped of my gear. But in the next episode, we will get out of here and get the key from the guard. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I shall see you next time.